Uh, my main focus is to reform IT telecom platform. We cannot continue the same way as we did over the last 45 years. And we found a op great opportunity for us to refocus our IT telecom platform to something new, relevant, useful, and we found SME. And SME, small, medium-sized entrepreneurs, are very active in our ICT business chain. And uh, ICT SMEs everywhere in the world were recognized as a very good uh, economic enablers and to help the country to develop their national economy and also, of course, create jobs. But for us, we found that uh, SMEs are a rich source of innovations because they provide a lot of uh, solutions, projects to support our modern technology like uh, mobile, like uh, internet. And therefore, we consider this is a very good uh, uh, opportunity for us to you know, create a new platform to invite uh, international families to come together to, to look at our market issue, to look at the future. In our event, we still have mainly pavilion of exhibitions and we have also forums. These are the you know, form we normally used in the past. But however, if you look at uh, the, our pavilions, this time you will find the pavilions are full of SMEs from developing countries. In the past, pavilions could uh, be a place to exhibit uh, the telecom uh, new technology and new services as the exhibition of these new technologies, new services. But uh, this time you will find pavilions are full of ICT SMEs from developing countries, number one. Number two, you know, in addition to this uh, pavilion of exhibitions and uh, forum, we also create dialogue between SMEs and the government, between SMEs among themselves, between SMEs and big companies, so that uh, the, our SMEs could have uh, some kind of opportunity to contact with the others to get more knowledge about uh, what will happen in the future in our market. And also, I think that uh, it's uh, very good that we should recognize those uh, SMEs with their excellent result of projects. Therefore, this time, for the first time, ITU will issue excellent award to some top projects, you know, selected by our, our, our members. And we also recognize uh, those uh, national excellences presented by a national authority to ITU. We will, for the first time, uh, provide such kind of award. And of course, in the, end, in the end of the event, there will be a great event to invite uh, students from uh, Budapest and from Hungary to join our SMEs, you know, to have such kind of uh, opportunities to share their feelings, to share their uh, ideas, and I think that uh, all these are new. The so next few days will be very busy for us. We have um, uh, pavilions, and we have also forum sessions. And forum sessions, you have uh, a group of uh, industry leaders, you have uh, policy makers, you have uh, government officials, particular ministers, and you also have academia, you have NGOs, all come together. You know, this uh, uh, forum sessions will provide us a very good opportunity to understand uh, the challenges, opportunities today in, f in front of our industry, in front, uh, faced by our market. And we also you know, have opportunities to have this kind of internet, uh, international networking of uh, uh, SMEs with uh, government officials, with uh, investors, with big companies. And this is uh, something you know, that uh, we really want to, uh, you know, to create and then to demonstrate the values of this event to facilitate global economic development by supporting ICT SMEs.
I would uh, very much uh, like to express my sincere appreciation for them to come to our telecom 2015. And I already talked with many friends that IT will reform IT telecom platform. And this is the first time we reform our telecom platform. So the participation by our members, by industry, by academy, by SMEs, uh, absolutely in a great encouragement to ITU's uh, initiative to reform this uh, uh, process. And also, I also like to take this opportunity to express my uh, assurance to all the participants that IT will continue its effort to reform this platform, to create a momentum to support ICT SMEs, and to support new technology innovations, to support uh, new ICT development, which will bring the benefit of new technology, new services of ICT to our people for next uh, two decades or even longer.